Welcome to Eric Blackman Music. Hi, in this tutorial I'm going to give you a quick lesson on bass guitar. So let's get going. Hi, and welcome to my tutorial on getting around on five string electric bass. The five string bass is tuned B, E, A, D, and G. Now one of the advantages to having a five string bass over a four string electric bass is that we have this low B string. So if we're playing in a band where the guys are tuning down somewhat on the electric guitars, you can use this low string to get notes that you wouldn't normally be able to get. Say for instance if a band was playing in drop C, you could easily go to a C by just going to the first fret like that because you've got a low B here that doesn't happen on an electric four string bass. Our electric four string bass is typically tuned E, A, D, G. So there's no way we're going to play a note lower than E on this bass. Now the low B string on this bass is very deep and sometimes it's a little hard to hear. You get a little bit of a rumble. If you want a nice tight sound on that bass, go back to your high pickup next to the bridge and play the string from here. Notice it's a lot brighter and clearer here than it would be here on the neck pickup. And that's why you will see some bassist back here. They get a brighter tone when they play back at the bridge pickup. What we're going to do in this video is learn how to play major triads on the bass. A major triad is a three note melody that makes up a major chord. For instance, if your guitar player was playing a B major chord, we go to the B string and go open. Take our index finger, go to the fourth fret, D sharp, and then we go to the fifth fret, and we get F sharp. B, D sharp, F sharp. Now when I'm making that stretch, I'm not stretching my hand all the way to that note. I'm playing the note with my index finger and releasing and moving up. Now to, in order to improve your reach, put your thumb behind the neck down as low as you can get it. And then your reach is going to be improved. Even if you have short fingers, if you get your thumb down low enough, you'll be able to reach the strings. See that? Much more than I need. So. What I'm going to do is put my thumb back here, put my hand over the fretboard like this, turn it, and then come around, and that'll tell me where I need to be on that neck. Now what we're going to do is play B, D sharp, F sharp. Then we're going to go to the E string and play E, G sharp, B. Then we'll go to the A string and play A, C sharp, E. The D string, D, F sharp, A. The G string, G, B, and D. So if we play those in order, here we go. play all the way up and turn around and come back, it's going to sound like this. Turn around. 
down. Now what I would like for you to do is to learn each triad for each string. The B string, B, D sharp, F sharp. The E string, E, G sharp, B. A string, A, C sharp, E. D string, D, F sharp, A. And the G string, G, B, D. And if you can get that done, you can feel satisfied that you've gotten quite a bit accomplished on the five string bass. Thanks for stopping by and have a great day.